and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM The Bureau. This time I'm starting a timer. Yay! He remembered. Woo! Uh, anyway. Uh, can we move, please? No, there we go. Right. Um. Okay. But yeah, I was right about the muton, just didn't remember it being in that way when it was on the demo. It wasn't actually a demo, but you know what I mean, like the um, gameplay trailer type thing. Oh. Oh, um. crap, look at all this! The towers are just the first step. When they're built, a full invasion will be over in a matter of hours. Interesting. Very pretty and shiny, but you know, me. All right, Doc. All right, to the gun gate. Show me the transponder and let's get the hell out of here. The transponder is ready for your retrieval. Understood. I'll head back to you as soon as I'm captured. Huh. Interesting. So I went eerily quiet. Whenever you're ready, Carter. Yes, yes. <sighs> oh, oh. All oh, right, that's a uh, gizmo. Barnes, get the sky. Oh, the alarm. We're gonna need. Downward transporters are cut off. There's nothing I can. Your other places to run. Come outside. I have something to show you. Oh? Really? Why do you flee from the inevitable? Who is this? The translation of my name in your language would be Axis. And despite what you believe, I am not. Tell that to your soldiers. Huh. I wonder if he's the turning point. Ah? Ah? Oh, okay. Our empire has a place for all. No more. A prisoner. I'll find it especially. I'll never be one of your slaves. Oh, okay. Lay down a mine. Unfortunately, Area secure. Did you feel that way? Ah, bugger! I went to the wrong side. I want that grenade. Well. I wonder what Axis is all about. There's Mosaic, there's Axis. Oh, hello. If we can't go down, at least we can go up. Find that area. No, 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 no. I'm trying to hit Silicoid Blob. Deploying blob! Put a fling there, and... Lifting! Lift you up, because why not? Reloading! Join the All targets down! I wonder what happens when we're both standing inside the thingy at the same time. Like I'm standing inside the ring and he's standing inside the ring up top. I wonder what would happen. If we'd end up binding together, or if there's some kind of safety mechanism. Or if, um, you know, they would just um, interchange places. Oh. Tell me you've got a plan. Carter, come in. Bunch, we're here. 
Roof of the tower. You think you can stop our invasion? You can't even escape. <laughs> <laughs> you can't even kill us. You think you can start an invasion? If you're gonna you know, use that kind of logic. Well, you can't escape. Well, you can't kill us. Wow. Although you have a couple of times already, but, you know. Shh. Let's be quiet about that. Um, let's get a blaster launcher again. A blaster launcher, I mean, again. Because blaster launcher is fun, right? That's it. Where are you, Axis? You will come to me. In time, prisoner. Oh my! Show yourself, you fucking coward! Hello? I don't like the looks of this! Find cover! Now! Nor do I, to be honest. The force is the only thing you understand. Oh my! Oh you crap! Yes, yeah, said that. You can't handle a direct hit from oh. that thing. You cannot conceal yourself from the truth. Put an end to it now. Okay, that was interesting. We need some rockets. Place it out of there, please. Um, I can't even target it just to, you know. Uh finish it off. Uh, no, 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 no. Ouch. Hide. I need help. Come on. Help me, please. No, no, no. I just need one more opportunity to hit this. There we go. Did you see that? Oof. Find new cover. Bloody you can't hell. A direct hit from that thing. We're still here. Put an end to it. Now. I will leave you to consider your chances against something of greater potency. <laughs> Repeat. Can you hear me? Barnes, we're ready for evac. Now. Jesus. Hmm. You're alive. Coming in. Let's get the hell out of this place. Also, did anyone else notice there was a slight audio glitch there? Where my guy was well still... You and your team did it. Yeah, but what did it cost us? They're winning, Doc. <sighs> With a transponder you nap back there, now we can strike back. Hmm. I guess. Anyway. Overview. Oops. Infiltration of the enemy structure designated S1 and retrieval of the classified device were successful. Agent De Silva, missing and presumed killed in action, was discovered to be alive and infected by a sleepwalker pathogen. Sorry, Agent De Silva, recovered alive for study, has been commended for his valor in the successful communication of critical intellig intelligence relating to the S1 civilians. Structure S1 civilians are infected by the sleepwater passive uh, <laughs> pathogen were seen entering the S1 without fear or coercion. Alright, coercion. Once inside the S1, the field team discovered that the civilians were being loaded into transport vessels and taken to points of unknown um, interest. Uh, points of unknown? Wait a minute. Taken to points of unknown. Taken to police... Ah, oh, whatever. Immediately prior to the extraction, the field team successfully engaged and destroyed a Titan-class enemy vessel while with conventional weapons, a feat previously thought impossible. Uh, I wouldn't say a blaster launcher was, um, you know, much of a standard weapon, but whatever. Or conventional weapon is kind of a bloody rocket launcher after all. Ah uh, well, anyway. 
That tower is still sending people to the other side. If we act quick enough, we can launch a rescue up. Oh, so why is it all stuttering? Um, you want to tell me what's going on here? I asked the lab to devise a test to root out any more infiltrators. We're testing everyone going in or out of the base. Taking the quarantine. Okay. Too bad about the Silva. Ah, uh, Falk. <laughs> Heinrich is isolated. One of Mosaic's imperative commands. Sorry about the stuffing. I don't understand. Noise, but to an outsider, so much. Proceed, Doctor. <laughs> He's reacting. <laughs> William. Carter. William. Carter. Huh. Agent Carter, I'm sorry to be the one to break this to you. Where's Julia? While you were away, there was... there was an accident. What? Bullshit. What accident? A fire. fire. At your house in Arlington. Julia and Richard. Unfit for duty. You're drunk, Agent. Go home and sleep it off. Jules. Buried before I could say goodbye. This is your third disciplinary hearing, Agent. Let me go. He got me well. Let me help them. Dad! Let me go. Let me go. Awake now, are we? Yeah. He convinced I'm human yet? You're alive, aren't you? Something like that. Well, you should <laughs> be fine. The director left an order to send you to talk to him. Sorry. Okay. As soon as you woke up, I wouldn't keep him waiting. Okay, um, I don't understand this, but I'm going to try and just cycle the recording. Give me a sec. Nope, doesn't seem to have worked. Mm, still no. This is oh, this is horrible. Excuse me, Mr. De Silva. Let me just get another sample. Yes, of course. Good luck to you too. Hmm. Give me a moment. Sorry, I'm going to see if maybe there's something else I can possibly do. You know, I believe there's nothing I can do because even without recording, my frame rate is still down at 5 FPS, which is kind of crap. Good luck. Oh god, what Carter. the hell? Carter? Hello? Can anybody hear me? Anybody? Am I dead? Isn't there supposed to be something? Huh? Is someone out there? Who's there? Who are you? Carter. No. Help! Somebody help! Okay, interesting. <laughs> I have a feeling this is not actually real, but anyway. Sleepwalker screening warning, infirmary personnel. It has come to our attention that the new audio tone security screening is... Advi adverse reactions when performed on infected sleepwalkers. While outsiders display markedly increased aggression as a response to the tone, affected sleepwalkers display physiological signs of increased stress and ag... ag, ag Mutation. I'm very sorry, I'm failing miserably at speaking right now. Agitation. Consistent with increased pain. Agitation. Agitation. You know, when people are agitated. Agitation and consistent with increased pain. While we are studying the, the disturbing impact. 
implications of this connection between outsiders and infected humans, we must regretfully remind that all personnel... All personnel that this does not mean that infected personnel can be excluded from mandatory security screening. Huh. Okay. Ah, I'm very sorry about this frame rate. I have no idea what's causing it. Uh, oh, maybe all this daft effects. Wait a minute, I've turned physics off. off, I thought. Also, why is my frame rate better looking at physics plot? I'm so very confused. But I have you back, my friend. My friend, I have you. Yay! But what's up with this? This is weird. It's nothing to do with looking at that, or anything like that. It's just looking at the infirmary just cripples my frame rate. I mean, I can go through this easily, in this physical, like, physics cloth again. I'm sorry, give me a second, I'm confused at this. Uh, graphics. Advanced. Um, film grain on. I didn't remember doing that, but whatever. Field of view, 75. No, I turned that off, I believe. Always have 90. Never, th never 75. 75 is horrible. I really don't remember having the isotropic filtering that high. Uh, physics particles are off, but physics cloth is on. Oh, whatever. Bugger it. I'll do. Oh, God, that's crippling. Anyway. Lockdown situation is over. Big deal. I just don't see the difference. Right. I mean, whoop de doo the doors might be open, but where is there to go? Five minutes out there and you're gonna find yourself right back under the ground. At least we're this time, alive. six foot. Hmm. New security personnel to all base personnel with the development of an effective infiltrator screening test by Dr. Dustin and Dr. Veer. I can announce that we have now completed full tests of the basements. In basis personnel, I am happy to announce that you are all human and our security lockdown can be lifted somewhat. However, we cannot afford to become complacent. Any staff that return to the base will be subjugated to another screening. Uh, the base And base management reserves the right to perform random mandatory screenings as necessary. As before, all screenings will be accompanied by at least two armed guards. We thank you for your vigilance. Uh, with your assistance, we shall persevere. Don't look towards the uh, um, infirmary. I just cripples frame rate for no apparent reason. Just like, yes, you have a frame rate. No, you don't, stutter. Um... Then I get shot ten seconds in. Hello there. Hey, Carter. I heard about the silver. Tough choice, but you did the right thing, son. You think? How are you holding up, Carter? I've had better days. Whole human race has had better days. Hmm. <laughs> How are we holding up? Oh, pretty well, actually. We keep taking in more people, but Barnes has those choppers flying day and night, recovering food and gear from storehouses. We well, may make it through this year. Doing, oh, yeah, doing something. I still wouldn't bet on us. But we've got a fighting chance, and I hear that's thanks to you. Yeah, you're welcome. Now that you've seen the sleepwalkers, what do you think? Well, that's worse than I thought. <sighs> but at least they're safe in the infirmary. But even so... Uh, yeah, no, never mind. What's bothering you? No, it's not right to mention it, but we're losing a lot of food and water taking care of them. Without them, we'd have another four months of supplies. What else would you recommend? Well, nothing right now. But if this war turns into a long haul, we'll have to ask ourselves if we can afford to be so merciful. Hmm. Your old buddy Falk nearly had me shot. Don't worry, it's a game. Not the first time. Well, it'd have been a couple of times he nearly shot me, too. This isn't a joke. No, son. No, it's not. It's real goddamn life. And there's a lot more at stake than your ego. 
So walk it off, and try to remember that he's watching out for our whole species. But what if he starts abusing his authority? If that happens, I'll stand right beside you. But just fight one war at a time. Hmm. <laughs> That's everything I need. All right then. Good luck out there, Carter. I never actually thought of it more from that military perspective when we saved those people. You know? Gotta be honest, but... Sure is a nice chance, Never right? sacrifice sure, um, just civilians right? just so a couple of military men can have another couple of weeks. Oh, so can I get my had a thing for this silver? I was real broken up about what happened to him. Uh, you shouldn't believe everything you hear. Huh. Anyway, I'm gonna see if I can get my top hat back. No, my, not my top hat, my hat back. I want my hat back. I like my hat. And tactician pack. So tactician pack gives me oh stabilization assistance pack. Significantly increases damage. That sounds quite useful, I think. But tactician pack. Oh well, God's sake. Um, reduces damage taken from enemy fire and increases ability range and weapon damage. Ah, uh, yeah, still the most useful in my opinion. Um. Uh, it's actually half tempting to try some other guys. I think I'll keep the sniper for myself though, personally. But I might try one of these guys. Um Okay, medical break for you. Combat stims and proof ability. Uh, what's the combat stims do again anyway? Oh yes, yeah, the shield sphere. I wanted to try that. Disrupt um, pre med increases bleed out time. Uh, combat stims increases the combat performance of allies in the area of effect. Um, hmm. Interesting. Yeah, go for medical breakthrough because we'll be using the sniper a lot more to revive because you can cloak. Anyway, I'll take out you, so remove from squad, and we'll try Beatrice. Or Betis. Add to squad. Carter, can we get your suit back on? I kind of like the suit, it's a bit suave. No. <sighs> Can just change color, yeah. Oh, I guess um, black pants or trousers. I would call them trousers. I don't know why people call them pants personally. Uh, shoe. Uh, black. <laughs> yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I think black's pretty good color in my opinion. I just use black a lot. Uh, whatever. I'll do. I don't have a stripe, do I? Oh, whatever. Um... Where to now? We could talk to this guy. Yeah, not after the shit she just pulled. Hmm. Seen anything interesting in the field? Ah, uh, you know how it is. Rampaging alien hordes, bolts of deadly blue plasma, walking green machines from another world. It's green oh, plasma, not blue. You make it sound like an issue of Captain Thunderbolt. I don't have to try very hard. <laughs> what the hell has Falk so paranoid? You mean more paranoid than usual? Doesn't trust anybody but Weaver. God knows why. Weaver's always been a good agent. Certainly better than you. Except I'm not the one getting into screamy matches with the old man, am I? Ho ho ho! What that touch on there, it doesn't it? I don't know how anyone could have mistaken you for an alien. They have better senses of humor. Wow, I feel like shooting you in the face, mister. That's my punchline to a joke, you dick. Ah. Real 
Shadow Trooper. I don't know. If I were him, I don't think I would have wanted to come back. What are you talking about? I can't afford to take care of everyone. I'm just saying, maybe he could have gone out with a bang. Just because he's infected doesn't mean he's dead. Better to be half alive than not at all, pal. Hmm. <laughs> and anyway, it wasn't really his choice. I'm curious. Oh, we can actually have a look at the thing. Oh, great. Yes, um... What I'm curious about, though, is Shield Sphere. Can I protect... Uh, Get a shield up! Shoot in that area! I don't know why, I'm just curious. Don't ask. Will combat you combat Sam Senior? Oh? Oh, hey! Get back! Hey, what are you doing back there? Hey, but the... You don't like to move around? Oh, I'm confused. Whatever. Bugger it. Screw it, I don't care about enough. Just wish I could sprint. What was that? Oh, memorial wall. Thomas Niles, he was quite early on, so was he. John Kennedy. Yeah. Michael Raymond. I don't remember Michael Raymond. Who was he? When did he die? Signal from beyond. Oh right, those will be the other two guys that um, were killed. Um. <sighs> Another infected. William, could I have a bird with you? Okay, Henrik. We need to talk about that test of yours. My yeah. most sincere apologies for what happened at your screening, William. But as you can see, we have a more pressing matter at the moment. This man is infected. That's never happened in the base before. Or is this <laughs> another unexpected side effect of your test, Doc? Oh, now, meow. I'm quite sure this is from an outside source. But I need your help to find out where, and to do it without causing a panic. Oh, like usual. What this sort of help? turning into a sleepwalker, and I've seen how that goes. Unless you found a cure, I don't see how you're gonna help. It's not a cure, but it may be the first step. Well, what is it? I have discovered a way to detect sleepwalker infections at an early stage, before the symptoms present. It will let us treat the subjects earlier, or at least get a better understanding of the conversion process. Another test, Doctor? Not to fear, William. This time, you will be the one performing the test. But huh? quietly, if at all possible. The last thing we need is an infection scare. Precisely. Thankfully, the detective will find any infected within a large area. Here, check in operations, engineering, the main lab, the briefing room, and the hangar. That should cover the base. And if I find any other infected? Send them to see Dr. Hera. I will meet you there, and perhaps we can help these men. Oh, okay, sure. What happened during the test? It felt like my head was going to explode. Any idea what happened? I had no idea. Perhaps it was some resonance from your earlier exposure to the alien artifact. Tell me, how did it feel? Like someone was inside my skull using a hammer, trying to break free. It was all I could do to stay conscious. Yes. And you said something, too. Your name? Perhaps your rank as well? Hell if I know. <laughs> For a few seconds, it was all just a red haze. Well, I am glad you are with us again, my friend. Okay. What you was that, that noise during the screening was something from Mosaic. How did you discover that? Dr. Veer has been examining the device removed from our captive infiltrator. It would appear that this is how they receive commands from the Mosaic network. So they're radio operated? Not quite. But it seems to give them a sort of subconscious connection to a larger command hierarchy. And you used the command for attack. You couldn't pick something safer, like dance? Our control is too crude for specific commands. Only general urges. And violence is a very common response, William. <laughs> I'll be on my all? way. As you say. But if you would like, you I have some light experiments hides. I could perform on yeah, I don't know, something else. No. I'll check for infected. But I've spent quite enough time as your guinea pig for today, Doc. 
You could have went with something a bit more... Oh, I don't know. A less aggressive and more like... Oof, let's just see... I don't know. Let's go for laughter. If the person randomly laughs for no apparent reason, then... There's something wrong? No? No, okay. No infected here, at least. Oh no, this agent is infected. Oh no, how bad. Heal him. Oh, fine then. <laughs> Sorry, I'll have the description, but just... Oh no, this agent is infected. I had a feeling one of the people in here was a bit dozy because they went and said the same thing as uh, another person. One of them went something like, "Yes, Agent Weir, and he went, yes, Agent, Agent Weir." Get to the infirmary, huh? Why? Just get moving <coughs> now. Oh, okay. Okay, we've got some more down there, but we can't get through this way, I don't believe, so we'll go around in this direction. Sorry, I'm trying to remember the layout of the base. It's been quite a while. Oh, okay. So at least command isn't infected. I've got your little welcome home party, Carter. Glad to see you're still in one piece. Yeah, so am I. Thank you for your concern, I guess. I think it was concern, right? Yeah. We'll just go with concern. Uh, da -da -da -da. So, is he good, Doctor Heinrich? Ah, hello. There we go. Oh no, this agent is infected. <gasps> Terrible. Autopsy report on the outsider elite. The outs elites have heavily armored and shielded ground troops on the outsider forces and combine peak physical development with all of their species and advanced tactical training and a f vigorous ferocity that can surprise even trained field agents. Elites are equipped with shields, automatic weapons and grenades and often work in conjunction with multiple outsider grunts and the commander. Elites appear to be veteran of many previous outsider conquests and different specimens often carry a small trophy of their past campaigns. If we successfully repel this invasion, our analysts, oh, sorry. our analysts have a lifetime of work to study these fragments and learn about the outsiders' military history and other spe species of our galaxy. You know if we make it through this. Don't even start. No, really. If we pull through, this technology's gonna change the world. Got some news for you. It already did. Dun dun dun! Anyway. Oh, wrong button. Lab notes, Dr. Weir. Unfortunately, we have yet to be um, yet to be able to intercept or fully understand the degree of mosaic communication. We have proven that we can crudely simulate the most basic um, imperatives with a combined of infrasound and high frequency tones. I, we believe that a third tone that acts, as a, acts to refine the imperatives, but we have yet to isolate its frequency. If it is indeed fashioned, is indeed the fashion in which we it has transmitted. Currently, we have found one imperative that can be reliably broadcast: primitive primal aggression. I subjugate the emotions. I suspect the emotion's simplicity is the reason it can be broadcast with only two frequencies. Okay. Hmm. The Style of Leash Titan. Study of the limited sample of the Titan material collected by the intrepid XCOM agents shows many shared properties with the substance constructing silicoids, whether Titans or silicoids are themselves sentient and can be regarded as living as mere, are merely examples of highly advanced technology remains uncertain. Titans are massive airborne enemies capable of shifting both shape and function. Field agents are strongly advised to find hardened cover where Titan shifts 
into a distinctive O-shaped firing form, though this does expose what appears to be a vulnerable control core. Right, so that's what all that yellow was all about. No, orange was all about. Uh, also, I don't understand why Illyrium apparently looks like vomit. Also, what is that noise? Actually, you know what, just to get this over with. Agent, you need to report to the infirmary. What? But I... I feel fine. Don't argue with me. Just report to the infirmary now. Or I'll punch you. Oh, he teleported. Ah, uh, yes. What is that? I wanna know, what is that? Do it again! Whoa! Sorry. That's quite cool. Well, Hello. doctors, got yourselves a new toy? I assure you, the Illyrium coil transfer rifle is no toy. <clears throat> what I mean to say is that we are testing a potential weapon for Mr. Barnes. Don't we already have access to the outsider's weaponry? Have you improved on it? There is always room for improvement, Carter. Oops, always sorry. a smoother transfer mechanism. Or a, a more advantageous dispersal pattern to search for. And you've just got to find it, don't you? Or die trying. <clears throat> so to speak. <laughs> it's awfully big. It's going to be hard to fit that into a holster. Yes, very funny. But once we test the fundamentals, we can work on the miniaturization. And it'd still be useful? Oh, yes. By combining our ballistics know-how with the enemy's energy weapons, we are on the cusp of a new horizon in weaponry. Combining huh. alien technology and our own. Interesting. Oh, okay, How that's this a bizarre if you ask me. Work? Uh, it's very simple, really. Imagine a Tesla coil, only with its voltage focused through a charged Illyrian ballistic delivery system. In English. It's a lightning cannon. I can see how that would be useful. Hmm. You need, you need any help, help testing it out? We were hoping you would ask. Our usual assistant seems to have disappeared again. Uh, not literally disappeared, mind you. No, no, of course not. That never happens. You were saying? <laughs> uh, yes, the machinery is in position. Just press the button and stand clear. And try not to disappear. That's all you want me to do is press a fucking button? Yes, I'm sure you'll be a great help. Only what appropriate that a field agent be involved. And all that. If you'd be so kind as to press the button on the device, we can continue testing. Is that it? You just seriously want me to press a button and you'll fire it yourself, you lazy arsehole? I'm You're not sure that's going to be much use in the field, doctors. Oh dear. Let me just adjust the discharge. Hmm. Yes, try it again. They've obviously had it at some point before, huh? That looks more like it. Quite satisfactory. But I believe we can do better. Increasing power levels again. Try now. Okay. I'm gonna stand back. Yeah, <laughs> that feeling. <laughs> I think you've still got some problems to iron out, doctors. Is everyone all right? Better than all right. Did you see the yield? Off the charts. It's a miracle we weren't killed. Fantastic! <laughs> I like these guys, they're quite cool. They're mad as shit though, but they're quite cool. Anyway, let's get out of here and leave these guys alone. Oh, uh, Mr. Tesla. I'm just gonna call you Tesla. Oh, no. Uh, those guys are mad. It's ladies, but they're mad. when I passed that crowd's test. You were afraid you were an alien? Not exactly. More like I was afraid the test would say I was an alien. I don't think it was the kind of test you get to take twice. Hmm. <laughs> well, I did get to take it twice in the way that I'm still alive right now. Officer, is the prisoner behaving himself? Huh? Oh, yes. He's been quiet. Something on your mind? S sorry, Carter. It's just... I've had a lot on my mind recently. Oh, so how is how's our friendly local infiltrator doing? He's been pretty quiet since you had a talk with him. Almost like he's hmm. meditating or something. 
But I couldn't say what's going through his head. Our last talk was rather revealing. Any chance I could talk with him again? I don't recommend it. But if you go in there, we'll have witnesses on hand to make sure the person who walks out is still you. Better than having to take that test again. And what's, what's wrong? wrong? Must be pretty important to bother a trooper like you. It's my girl back in Iowa. She's been taking care of some survivors in a big farmhouse, and she sends transmissions every day, but... But what? Latest transmission, she sounded really tired, and uh, said she found traces of black goo on her pillow. Oh, Shit. dear. I'm sorry. They're already sending a team to recover as many of them as possible. I just hope she gets back here in time. Is anyway, this going to affect about. your duties? No. No, sir, not at all. See that it doesn't. Oof. Remember who you're guarding here. Oh, that's Be about careful, Rose. Deckish. A distracted guard is a dead guard. Either get over it, or get a replacement. Yes, sir. It won't be a problem, sir. And, uh... Good luck. Oh, he's softening up. Oh, how nice. Hello. Hmm. Still wondering where that sleeve thing is, but whatever. Welcome back, William Carter. It is pleasant to see a familiar face. You're in a good mood for a prisoner of war? As are you. Which means you have recovered a phase plotter. So <laughs> you plan to go through with your suicidal attack? So, you really want to see the end of Mosaic? Tell us where they're taking the sleepwalkers, and how do we cure them? I would not know. I am a warrior, not a scholar. I do not know if it can be cured. We'll see. You must Tell me know about something Axis. about Axis. If we go after him, what should we expect? Axis? The Primarch. You are an ambitious creature, William Carter. Axis, <laughs> Primarch. Whatever you call him. He is wise and patient. There is a reason Mosaic called him to lead. Do you think it a coincidence mm. that your planet fell so quickly to him? He's not that smart. We've already tracked him down. Of course you have. He will let you come to him and then he will destroy you. This is suicide, William Carter. What's your name? What are you called? You do not understand how Mosaic functions. When we are connected, we are Mosaic. Individual names are unimportant. You're not connected anymore. What do you call yourself now? I... do not know. I have never been concerned with it. Maybe you should. Help us win, and I'll call you whatever you want. Hmm... I... don't know what he would be called, to be honest. Stick around. Do I have a choice? Of course not. Be cautious, William Carter. Hmm... If you, if you read down there, there's a note for it. By what, like a dog whistle? Yeah, sure. pretty much. A really complicated dog whistle. Anyway, uh, how do we get in there again? Oh god, I can't remember. Oh, hello. Hello. The hell was that all about? Okay, never mind. Um, notes. Weir and Darson screening protocol. Dr. Falk, after much study of the mosaic communication device extracted from the uh, infiltrator in November, Dr. Diz then and myself have made progress in understanding the nature of the outsider communication. This leads to our, our practical application for security screening. By playing a combination of tones, one at approximately 4 kHz, and the other at exactly 18.25 Hz, we appear to be able to create a mosaic violent imperative. Any outsider exposed to this will be overwhelmed but with sensations of aggression and panic, regardless of the condition or disguise. However, to humans, the combine combination merely produces a high-pitched hum and perhaps certain sensations of movement. Note, at the that this tone must be administered carefully as a human eyeball 
has a resonant frequency of 18.98 hertz, so poorly adjusted tone can cause pains, headaches and temporary visual hallucinations. Details of our research are attached. We trust this will assist in security screening. Okay. At the end of the video, what I think I'll do is actually produce this in Audacity. And I'll put it at the end of the video for the last, say, 30 seconds. See if any of you are aliens. Hmm. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'll do that. Because why not? That'll be fun. The music test frequency. Everyone, like 20 people, get headaches after listening to this video. Well, bugger. Don't sue me, please. I'm sorry. Um, do we come through here? I can't remember anymore. Oh god, how do we get through there? Aww. Oh. Hmm. Okay. I don't know if you'd be able... Ah, uh, well. A lot of people would be able to hear the lower one, but... And the higher one would be extremely simple to hear. Um, the 4 kilohertz is extremely simple to hear. Uh, the other one it might be a bit bassy for a lot of people to hear. But we'll see if it works. And by a bit bassy, I mean extremely bassy. Also, where the hell am I meant to go? Give me a second and I'll find out where I'm meant to go and then I'll be back. I just thought, that's, I'm not meant to go down there, that's the thing. Because that's where Heinrich is. And he's got the people. Because earlier on there was only two in there. And then I got the guy down here, so there's three in there now, so yeah. Okay, so I believe we're finished with this part of the um, room. Go through to the next one. Hmm. Believe it or not, no I haven't. Uh, right, so... There doesn't seem to be any more. Hmm. I'll go to engineering though. I think that was the next one right, where we were meant to go to. I believe. Um, nope, nothing. Keep moving along, though. I want you to check and double check everything. If you went over it, go over it again and again, just to be sure. Carter, you'll never believe what we found. I would like to know, cause your voice is really strange. Just checking the area for safe working conditions. All clear. We caught a spy sneaking into the event. Oh, no did he? Here. Shit. Did he do any damage? Don't think so. We're double checking, but I think we got him before he could do much. Another outsider infiltrator. God damn it! Not an outsider, a Russian. What? We get attacked by aliens, and we still have to keep our eyes open for Reds. Those commie bastards never give up. <laughs> Interesting. A Russian? Russian. How did he get in? Been down here for a while. He got himself assigned to the hangar before the attack. Did he managed to evade capture this long? I'd like to talk to this fella. Where is he? In the foreman's office, right over there. Falk wants him debriefed before we shoot. Huh. Don't shoot me, talk maybe you Russian. Seems like a lost cause to me, but good luck. Oh, hello. Oh, no, <laughs> keep pressing me. Let's go to the trace. This night, but you this, this. How did someone that speaks God, only Russian manage to get in? You think that will make me talk? You are weak. All of you, weak. Uh, oh, come on. Right? He has an accent like that and you didn't suspect him to be Russian. You are weak. All of you, weak. Yeah, that's very Russian if you ask me. Я не знаю, если вы это 
но голодная война отметнена. У нас гораздо серьезнее гроза. И у вас тоже. Пришельцы? Да, я слыхал эту историю. Вы думаете, что я совершенно глупой? Слушай, я был там, вверху. Все правда. Половина мира мертвая, а другая половина заражная. Не может быть, что только в нас ударили. Я обещаю, что двоим друзьям Сесесер так же плохо, как здесь. Но, если какой-нибудь из них все еще жив. Да это просто смешно. Как ты можешь это доказать, а? Голоса по радио и подделанные фотки. Скажи мне, почему я должен верить твою сказку? проблема. Ты думаешь, это сработает? <laughs> Ты слабый. Вы все слабые. Дают себе предложение. Я пошлю тебе на папу. Сам можешь убедиться. Если то, что говорю, верно, вы работаете на меня. Если нет, вы можете убить на Кубу. Если я не позволяю себя обманывать. Что ты заботишься? У вас будет оружие. Вы будете отсюда. Так или иначе, вы не будете моей проблема. Ладно, дай мне увидеть этих пришельцев для себя. Довольно иметь вас на борту. Окей. So we now have a man on our side. Hope you don't mind me listening in, but I think you did the right thing. We need all the help we can get. How do you know what we said? Are you Russian? Well, well, uh, let's not answer that. That commie is something, but I think he's going <sighs> to come around. You can't trust him, Carter. Well, it's humans against aliens right now, not Americans against Russians. I need someone to take him out to see what the aliens have done firsthand. If you say so, I'll set up a recon mission. Let's just hope he remembers who the good guys are. Okay. Um, unlock dispatch mission, the Russian and Palma, New Mexico. Return to Ops dispatch um, agents. Sure thing. We'll do that afterwards, though. Huh. So anyway, other way we can, you know, housekeep the base a bit. Uh. So we've been to engineering, we've been to the firing range and the armory, I believe. We've been to the infirmary and the lab. Um, what else? But did we go back to the infirmary? Um, oh, let's have a look back at the infirmary, I guess. Armory, infirmary, sky range. Oh god, this is going to be torture again, isn't it? Apparently this way. Uh, we've already been here. Ah, oh, god damn base is tricky to navigate in my opinion. Sorry. Also, people seem to be setting off fireworks before the 5th of November. Hmm. Apparently it's only the 17th. Of um, October. Uh, nope, they're not in the air. Okay. I believe I'm finished with this, but I don't know, to be honest. Okay, we can't go to the Sky Ranger. We've already checked the hangars. Uh, ops no laboratory. Yeah, I went there. Ready room. We went there. I believe we scanned the ring there. If we've not, then not uh, to hell with it. I don't care enough. Uh, no, oh. Sorry, there's a, the game I'm currently playing right now uses a spacebar instead of E, so I keep pressing the spacebar. Anyway, Carter, the Silva has you... and does have... Ah. Carter, the Silva and us used to have a drink or two after hours. What, after what happened, we figured we could use a bottle for yourself, Percy. All right, boys, get your gear in order and gather around. This gonna it's be another vehicle. rescue cakewalk, sir? Or are we gonna see some action? Nothing so boring this time, Kenny. No. This time we're going into the belly of the beast. 
All right, it's about time. Some of those sleepwalkers are congregating at a tower out in New Mexico. We're gonna find out why and shut them down. You sure we won't catch anything being around all those sleepwalkers? You just worry about us getting into that tower. Alive. Yes, sir. This is gonna be an extended stay. Investigating the area, finding a point of entry, and infiltrating. We're gonna keep a low profile. Until we can strike. Less John Wayne and more James Bond? That's the spirit. And if we're lucky, we might even find a cure for the sleepwalkers. Is that even possible? Hell if I know. But we gotta hope, right? Otherwise, why are we still fighting? <laughs> Did they put that echo deliberately on to say, Ooh, it's the past! Uh, should I really have the drink, though? There's a button on this to press, apparently. It's flashing. I'm trying to answer it, but nothing. Should we really have a drink when he's been uh, an alcoholic in the past and couldn't do the job because he was drunk? Anyway, let's get some agents on um, a mission. Uh, agent management. May as well get some of these guys. Um, what's it called? Abilities and stuff. Disrupt or weaken? I guess we'll do weaken. Oh no, we did weaken beforehand. Uh, disrupt. <laughs> yes. The support agent drops an enemy's shield yes, yes. and temporarily disables them. Yes, I'm trying to skip it. There we go. Um, Pitsman. Demolitions expert or shotgunner? Well, we already have one with the main ability recharging faster, so we'll get the shotgun. Uh, machine gunner, I guess. Um, I thought it was always a bad thing to have tunnel vision, though, in the middle of a combat situation, apparently. Yeah, there's a perk in this. Hmm. Nope. Oh. Wrong thing. Um, mission selection. Let's have a look at Palma, New Mexico. Select agents. Sinclair. Select agents. Hordevan. Actually, we'll go look McFall. No, we. We'll go for Hardvan, actually. We will go for him. And the sniper. Uh, launch mission. Um, we could go there and do that, but we'll wait for that for now. Sleepwalker research. Um, Maryland Falk FT. Um, Fount no, uh, Fort De Dietrich, I think. I could be wrong with that, Maryland. An isolated team of army scientists, the nation's most advanced biological weapons facility, have barricaded themselves in the laboratory as they s research the sleepwalker infection. Our operatives have been unable to observe their progress as they are extremely secretive and paranoid of potential infiltrators, even refusing deliveries of food and supplies from, out the, from the outside. Interesting. Terror on the river. Memphis, Tennessee. Rumours have spread of a mysterious watchtower being constructed in the nearby village of Blytheville. Blytheville. Promoting the National Guard to build a makeshift defensive perimeter around the city of My Memphis. Meanwhile, some claim that strange black sludge has been seen floating in the Mississippi River, sometimes moving against the current. Huh. <laughs> uh... Portland, Oregon. The Oregon Trail. Um, operatives of Portland, Oregon, rumours have... report rumours that the nearby town of Vanport City has been destroyed by flooding after a breach in the dike holding back near the nearby Columbia River. Some reports mention strange new construction in the area, possibly um, responsible for the breach, but they have agreed on one fact. No survivors have been found in the town's 40,000 residents. Yeah, it's a bit too thorough for a 
breach. We'll see. Anyway, yeah. I guess we'll have a look upstairs. Um, I love found him, Myron. He's so close. Put me on this mission, and I'll hand you his head on a platter. We're sending Carter after Axis. This is what he does. Then send us out together. No one's going anywhere until we know where to look. Huh. Agent Weaver, I know why you want to go after Axis. I cannot allow personal feelings to interfere with the mission. Okay. Hmm. Something going on I should know about? There you are. Agent Weaver has tracked access to the Pacific Northwest. Oregon. His base is in Oregon. I'll leave it to the two of you to narrow down our search area. Something smaller than an entire state. <laughs> yeah, that may be a we bad should talk, Carter. Yes, give me a second. Notes. Um, intercepted memo. Director. Found this partial note on the trash and caught my eye. Thought you might want to see what um, the people are saying. Anonymous. Then what's the point, damn it? Cities have been evaporating every vaporized every day. Falk doesn't trust any of us, even with the lockdown over. Where are we supposed to go? We have no home. I say we go down to whatever's left in Vegas and live out the end of our of the world in style. We're all going to end up like those zombies in quarantine, so why um not have some fun, I'm assuming it's going to be Falk, you're not doing a very good job, basically. Right, so what do you want? Angel. Uh, Agent Weaver. It's okay, Will. How are you feeling? I'm like hammered shit. But I'm still here. Good. We're onto something. Um, I don't know. Let's get to it. The sooner we find access, the sooner we finish this. I couldn't agree more. You said he was in Oregon. You have anything more than that? I've tracked access to Southwest Oregon. Somewhere remote. Hm. Everywhere in Southwest Oregon is remote. There's a lot of forest out there. Enough room for access to hide. But I found something. Radio signals. And they're not ours? No. I triple checked. Mm. And Weir confirmed it. The broadcast isn't human. What I could translate mentions access repeatedly. I think they have some sort of facility there. Well, of course they possibly do. Um, we're close, well, I know radio that. radio operators might have heard something. I have this feeling we're real close. Your instincts seem to have done us well. Let's hope you're right again. Don't worry, we'll find him. I'll go see what Chelsky can track down for us. And I'll check in with Weir, too. Meet me back at Falk's office when you're done. Okay, sure. Um, first off, though, let's actually take a swig of that. Because why not? No? Just why not? Maybe there's something interesting. Here's to you, Nico. Rest in peace. He's not dead. <laughs> He's hefty. <laughs> hey, let's and go for it. You too, Kenny. Rest in peace, kid. He's dead. Right? Okay. Nico's alive. Kenny's um and dead. To Nils. Rest in peace. Nils is dead. Yes. There. Now, no more. Or is there? And J. Edgar Hoover. And Pima, New Mexico. <laughs> and the USA. I'm sorry, I'm just playing around here. I'm wondering what's gonna happen. I'm, I'm sorry, uh, I'm curious. And uh, to William Carter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's me. Anyway, I think we'll leave it there, and until next time, all the best, and I hope you enjoyed being judged by two people standing in the corner. Yay!
Also, now that I think about it, we're going to ha hear the outsider call thingy my bob. So if anyone turns over tables, I'm sorry, but we have to check. You know, just we have to check. And what was that thing that you keep saying? Um, keep observing. Uh, whatever that doctor f director fault keeps saying. Um, we must persevere or something like that. Anyway, until then, all the best, and I hope you enjoyed.